Hi uh, guys, what I have here is an Amazon Kindle 5th generation. What I'm going to do for you today, what I'm going to show you is how to hard reset this. Reasons being for doing this sort of thing is if you're having software issues like freezing, crashing, or if you've got a password on there which you're forgetting or whatever, you know, that's some of the reasons why you would do it. Well, anyway, what you'd do is you'd make sure that the tablet is turned off completely where there's nothing on there at all what you've got is you've got the two buttons at the top that's the volume buttons and you've got the power button here right next to the charger socket what you would need to do is you need to press and hold both these buttons here and then the power button now what you do is you let go of the power button and then let go of both other buttons and then you've got the Amazon system recovery. You've got reboot system now at the top, apply update from ADB, factory data reset, wipe cache partition, etc. The one that you need is wipe data, wipe data slash factory reset. So you go back to that one, press power button, got all these no's, scroll down to yes. But before you press this, guys, just make sure that you know. And you understand that everything that was on there previously, i.e. apps, games, photos, videos, music, everything else, that will disappear. So if you're happy to proceed, you'll stay on yes, press the power button. And it says at the bottom, battery level is too low to perform, update, blah, 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 factory data, data wipe complete at the bottom. Then you press the power button again. Now it'll restart, fire, <sighs> should have really charged it up before I've done that, but the end result's still the same, so it makes no difference really. This can take a little while, it can take approximately 10 minutes, which it will tell you in a minute. Seeing what that was. So if you fancy a cup of tea and you were planning on making them on after this, so gonna grab yourself a can or a whiskey or anything, feel free to go ahead because it's the waiting game after this. Now as you can see, optimizing. System storage and applications. This will take approximately 10 minutes to complete. Like I said before, it can take 10 minutes. It can take 15, it can take 5. You know, it all varies really. It all depends on how fast it wants to go. What will happen after this part, you'll come up to the welcome screen where you stick your language in, whether you're in the States, in Spain, or just in the UK like myself. You just press on the relevant one, which I'll be pressed on the UK one. And then it will ask you to ask to put, to go into Wi-Fi and in the Wi-Fi password. So you, this process does require internet connection. You enter your Wi-Fi password and then it will be asking you to enter your Amazon account. Don't worry if you haven't got one. If you have, just enter your Amazon account, go through the steps and then that should be all done, which you'll see in a moment. I won't be entering my Amazon account. That's as far as I'll be showing you. But... Like I said, don't worry about it too much if you haven't got one, because there is an option there where you can create one. It's free of charge, doesn't cost you a penny. Which is the best way really, isn't it? Why pay for something when you don't need to? So 
And also don't worry about entering your Amazon account because you're wanting to sell it. Because what you can do after that is you can just go into the tablet, which I can show you in another video if you just want to click on the other video. I'll show you how to get on to the settings again and then remove your account. So then when you do come to sell it, your account's not on there with all your bank details and, and so on. Simple trick really.